Hello my dear WordPress lovers and welcome back to WP Globe YouTube channel. In today's video we are going to review the best WooCommerce product filter plugin by Barn2. This plugin enables you to provide your customers with a fast shopping experience. Your customers will be able to find the exact item they want due to numerous filters by price, category, attribute, color, stock and many more. So for now, let's have a deeper look at this amazing plugin. WooCommerce Product Filters is a professional plugin for adding filters to your WooCommerce store in a quick and easy to understand way. The plugin is beginner friendly, easy to manage and it can be super useful for both WordPress developers and WooCommerce site owners. The plugin enables you to add uh, flexible filters to your WooCommerce store, allowing you to create filters by any type of data, categories, price, tags, attributes, ratings, and so on. You can also display all the filters in the style you prefer. It can be images, color swatches, dropdowns, sliders, checkboxes, and many more. Now, let's go through the setup process of the plugin. Once you have installed the plugin from your WordPress dashboard, come down to WooCommerce, Products and then to Filters. On the open page in the right corner, click on Setup Wizard. Uh, this is where you need to type in your license key in order to activate the plugin. The setup wizard usually opens immediately after you install the plugin, so you can go through the same procedure right then, or you can leave it on later like we are doing now. Uh, on the first page, there is a drop-down that lists uh, all your filter groups. If you have only just installed the plugin, then there will be only the default filter group available. Uh, let's choose one of the filter groups that I have created beforehand. Uh, then there are also options for filter visibility and filter behavior. You can also change these uh, settings. After you are done uh, with the setup wizard, uh, click on uh, manage filters in order to start uh, creating your new filter groups or editing your existing filter groups. Here you can see the filter groups that I have created beforehand. This is the one that we decided to show on top of our store um, uh, on the wizard setup process. Uh, let's review it and learn how to make up a filter group on the example of this one. Here, in the example, you can see that the first thing we need to do is to write our filter group name. This name will be visible only in your WordPress admin, so it won't be visible for your customers. Uh, you can see that I have created two filters uh, within the filter group. It is gender and color. Let's have a deeper look at the uh, gender. Uh, again, you need to write filter name, but this one will be visible for your customers. Then you need to choose the um, aspect according to which uh, you want to filter your products. It can be categories, attributes, tags, price, etc. In this case, I have chosen attributes. Uh, then you can select the attributes uh, or show filters for all available attributes. I have chosen select attribute and here you can already choose the attributes that you have uh, in your store. Uh, so uh, as far as it is gender, I have chosen the gender. Uh, and finally, you can choose the uh, filter type. Uh, there are several filter types. It can be drop downs, check boxes, radio buttons and so on. For this one, uh, I have chosen radio buttons. Uh, so as you can see, it is rather easy. It is also very easy to add new filter. Simply click add filter button and uh, start typing in the information. Let's add it uh, the uh, filter of size uh, and choose again to filter by attributes. 
um, select attribute and here you can see that I have attribute of site among my um, products uh, product filters um, and then let's choose the filter type to be check boxes this time uh, after you are done uh, simply click save changes in order for them to appear on your store um, creating new filter is also very easy and quick uh, simply go back to the filters page click add new box and start in filling the information and follow the same steps of adding filters like we discussed previously for now let's see how to make the filters visible in your uh, wordpress site on your woocommerce store the simplest way is uh, to set up it uh, through the setup wizard as we did at the beginning of our video or you can also e set it up um, through the settings page of the plugin go to the settings uh, and on the filter group line uh, there is a drop down window for you to choose the filter group you want to display uh, on the top of your store then you can also decide on how to show it on mobile, select the filter rows and many more features. And of course, again, don't forget to save your changes in order for them to appear on your store. Besides, uh, you can also um, add your filter to your store in uh, another way by using shortcut. Um, you can simply copy your filter group shortcut and pass it on your Gothenburg um, editor so that it will appear on your website. So you can see it is relatively quick and straightforward to add new filter groups to your store and improve overall customer experience. That was much about adding product filters to your store with the help of WooCommerce Product Filters plugin by Barn2. This is a plugin that definitely worth your attention. The plugin is super flexible, it is highly responsive and it is compatible with all WordPress themes and versions. Plus, the plugin is great add-on for your WooCommerce store together with other products by Barn2 such as WooCommerce product table for adding filterable one-page order forms or uh, WooCommerce restaurant ordering for creating online food order form uh, with uh, different uh, requirements like vegetarian or dietary requirements and so on. Thank you for watching the video, I hope you liked it and don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel in order not to miss the best WordPress tutorials and WordPress plugin reviews. See you soon, bye!